guys, I'm back. I think it's been a while, almost a month since I last vlogged and uploaded a vlog to the channel, so hello! <laughs> so, uh, I decided to take like some time off after what happened with Yuna, because I was really not in the best of places, and emotionally I was not good, so... Yeah, I decided to take a break. I'm feeling a lot better. I'm still a little shaken and st still getting used to this situation because it's a lot of changes and it's pretty drastic. You're not eased into it, you're just thrown into it. So, yeah. But I am doing a lot better. Um, so that's why I decided to log in. Um, the house is very quiet. I'm still getting used to that. It's been a month and it's just hard to get used to. But yeah, but yeah I'm back to vlogging because I do miss it. <laughs> I do miss it quite a bit. Uh, today, day off, so um, I'm going to be editing a video, but first I'm going to go downtown with Ina to go to this Van Gogh thing that's been like a craze for Instagram and everything, so that'll be fun, but I heard it's a rip off, but you know, I need a new Instagram anyway, so I'm going to go downtown. I've been downtown like since the pandemic started, so two years now, so <laughs> that'll be fun. Um, I'm gonna come back after that to, uh, edit a video. I think it's up. I hope it's up. Ooh, burp. I hope it's up. It's the Yuna video. Hopefully it's up. If not, I'm sorry, but I'm pretty sure 90% it's gonna be up before this vlog is up. So, <laughs> I have a week to edit it, so I, there's no excuse for it. But yeah, I'm running late, so I'm gonna quickly go and meet Ina. We're taking the sky tree down. And then met up with the others now. Hello. Yeah, you saw already. He was here in. First on the vlog, you guys. Okay. And then there's that one there. That one. <laughs> Introduce yourself. What, what's, what's the newest complaint, Takumi? Complaint? Oh, um. Richmond said no, no, Tim no, no. Hortons? Not Tim Hortons. Um, oh, what is it there now? There was one recently. Uh, I gotta think. I gotta think. Uh... <laughs> it's okay, take your time. Hold on, hold on. Oh, 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 oh. Um, the spaghetti place in Burnaby. Tutorial, tutorial, tutorial. Then what oh. happened at tutorial? So, I literally, okay, I bought pasta recently. <laughs> all right, I'm like, okay, here's your order, sir. Here's your order, okay? And then next thing you know, I go home. They didn't give me a fork. But you're at home. But they were supposed to give me a fork. I told them I want a fork too. But you're at home. Yeah. Okay. So, lesson of the day is don't go to tutorial because they don't give you oh, forks. Hey, 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 one more, one more, one oh, more. Oh, okay. Don't go to Rich and Center Tim Hortons. They're, they're fraud. Period. They're fraud. Period. They're fraud. Period. Especially this one guy. One guy. He just looks at me when I get bagels and just, yeah. I guess he's he? the one who's cutting my bagels. I ordered <laughs> drink and they didn't want to give me my drink yeah, order. Cool. Yeah, Tim Hortons Rich, Rich and Center is a fraud. A fraud. F R A U D. Fraud. <laughs> How's the pressure? Are you good? Yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> I grilled before. I grilled a steak before. Ooh. I grilled a steak before. Oh, wow. A steak. My mom kind of helped out, so. Okay. <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations. We've been craving this forever. feeling so hot my stomach has been bothering me literally all day woke up this morning it was okay got to work but then like halfway through my work day it just was bugging me it's not bathroom related it's not covid related i think it's just i don't know what's going on 
because I think it's also the fact that last night, for some reason, my sleeping was probably one of the worst for a long time. I thought with what happened with Yuna passing and all that stuff, me sleeping, being sleep deprived was the worst for my health at that point because I was always tired. But this time, me not sleeping properly really affected my stomach, <laughs> which is kind of weird because last night when I was just editing videos, it was around midnight actually, I was like, oh my god, I'm so tired. You know what? I'm right showered. It's midnight, really early, I'm going to go to bed. I was actually quite happy. Fall asleep instantly, almost instantly, let's, let's face it. <laughs> Me falling asleep in 20 minutes is actually one of the best. Fell asleep and then I woke up and I'm like, oh wow, okay, must be like around 8 or 9 a.m. right now. Look at the clock, it's only 5 a.m. So I'm like, okay, that's weird because I'm still pretty tired. I'm surprised I just woke up. So I attempted to go back to sleep. It took me a while, I fell back asleep, and then I woke up at 7 a.m. And I couldn't sleep anymore, so whatever, I got the day. So when I added it uh, I technically didn't really achieve full sleeping. So, like, that for that long, I would say I probably got five hours of good full sleep. But I felt okay, so got up, did some stuff, did some cleaning around the house, and then I didn't hit me until 2 p.m. I'm like, oh my god, I'm dying at work. And then that's when my stomach started to think. Maybe it's because the last two days I've been eating out a lot. Like Monday was all out eating. Like Cactus Club, the Korean barbecue, like a lot of eating out. And then yesterday I ate out at the food court for my lunch at work. So it was just a lot of that. So that could be it. So my stomach was just like, hey man, stop. So today you saw me cook some meat. I would eat it with some salad. I barely touched the meat. I literally just ate the greens. Surprising, right? <laughs> I'll save the meat for tomorrow. So I, I decided to cook it off because it expires like tomorrow or in two days, so I probably fry it up, but yeah. I feel a little better. I drank some green tea. It's settling a bit, but I am exhausted. <laughs> so I'm probably just going to grab a shower and then take a break after the shower because you can't sleep right away after a shower because you're refreshed. Shower, uh, do a little relaxing and then try to sleep because I am pretty tired. I'm feeling much better today. It was just a matter of passing it because when it comes to your stomach, when it's that queasy and stuff, it's just a matter of time for your body to like digest and move on. I passed it, I feel a lot better. I still feel a little iffy, but that's not really noticeable, so yeah. Uh, the sleep definitely helped. <laughs> I slept early and I woke up around 10. And then I got up and then I went to have lunch with my dad for Father's Day because I I work on the weekends, so I might as well get that out of the way. He was free, I was free, let's go about lunch, was not busy. Got some yummy Greek food in Steveston. And then, because I was in Steveston, I went to Nankaido. Because <laughs> oh, no, I have to do. Because Nankaido is awesome, but they just have terrible business hours. They're open till five every day, except for Mondays. Like, worse. If I have to work, I can't go there after work. It's just annoying. Anyway, of course I bought stuff in Nankaido, not too much. I wanted to get these bowls, but the thing is, I wasn't that excited about it, and the cost wasn't going to be worth it. But I picked up some green teas, some different ones. So here's the first one. I got the Denmite, I probably pronounced it wrong. This is a really good, strong green tea. It's good for your tummy. <laughs> the reason why I got it. And then I got the Organic Jasmine Green Tea. This is like your basic, you probably drink this all the time. And then I got the Sencha. So, most likely you guys drank these two, because if you've been to a Japanese restaurant, you probably drank these two. It's the one with the... I may not, because it's more like on the bougie side of Japanese restaurants. It's the ones with the green tea leaves with a little bit of, like, flour in it. And rice. So, yeah. So, this one here is basically... Oops. This is tea leaves. And then, well, these two have rice in it. With the tea leaves. But yeah, they're both really potent, but also good for your digestion. Because of all the teas in the world, no matter what, I always prefer green tea. Not, not matcha powder, though, because that's... I don't mind matcha powder, it's just really bitter sometimes. And then I also picked up... And then one of these travel books got sold, because... You know how much I love Korea. 
<laughs> I'm gonna add that to my collection. I also bought something else, but I'll show you guys that later. Okay. So for now, the rest of the day, or where the plan now next is to, I'm just gonna quickly clean up a little bit of a mess I left last night, and then I'm just gonna work on the Una video, which I hopefully will finish in the next hour or so. It shouldn't take me too long. I just posted the Una video, I think like literally 10 minutes ago, and I just shared it with everybody. Hopefully you guys check it out. But I know I'm gonna get this question, I think maybe, or you guys are not with you, but anyway. If you guys are wondering what's in the blue box, <laughs> it's actually her urn. It's a very nice urn. Oh, she turned this light as well. It's late. It's a very nice urn, but because it comes in such a sturdy box, I figured I'll keep it in the box. Because dust-wise, I'll just keep it cleaner, right? For you know. But yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> This is actually me not just waking up for the day. I just came home from work. <laughs> I look like crap and I feel like crap. I don't know what's happened. I slept again pretty at a decent time yesterday, but again, I woke up very early. It just feels like I'm jet lagged for some reason. <laughs> it's always around six o'clock or seven o'clock where I feel extremely tired. So what I'm gonna do right now is I just go home, quickly get to grab a shower, literally be ready for bed. I'm not very hungry, but I'm probably gonna eat like some fruit or something, like a snack, so I don't wake up hungry or wake up to the morning starving. So there's something in my belly. And then as soon as a wave of like tired hits me, I'm going straight to bed and just sleep until the next day. Because <laughs> around nine, I usually get very tired again. So that's probably the time I'm gonna fall asleep again. But yeah, <laughs> feeling like crap today. The one thing I did today that wasn't work related was pick up a new shower curtain. <laughs> Riveting, isn't it guys? Super exciting. Basically, for a while now, my shocker, and first of all, it's really old. I should have replaced it a while ago. But my main issue is that once a month, once I when I do my deep clean in my bathtub, I discovered that this shocker has been, what's the word? Not leaking, but the color has been rubbing off onto the bathtub. Like, not inside the bathtub, but on this, the, the, the ledge here, but on that side, where this is touching. So, it becomes a little blue, and I was like, oh, what's going on? It's the, the shower curtain. So, yeah. At the beginning, it wasn't a lot, it was just like a little bit bad, but now every time I do a deep clean, I see it. <laughs> like, every week I give my bathtub a refresh, like quick sanitize, and I can clean it, but then every once a month, as I always say, I do a deep clean of everything in my house. So, yeah. <laughs> um... It is overdue to change it, I'll just change it because it's getting gross. But the reason I'm not changing it now is because I'm just going to wait till I do my deep clean. Because if I put this on now, the blue might appear on this new shower curtain, and I don't want that. So I'm going to do a deep clean, which is probably in like in a week, and then put the new shower curtain on. <laughs> yeah, exciting stuff, isn't it, guys? I actually started playing this game again on um, phone and tablet and stuff. Final Fantasy Record Keeper. I used to play this a lot. <laughs> I forgot when it came out. It came out a long time ago, but it's an app on the phone and on tablets or iPads. So there's constant updates. There's so many changes that I'm like, oh, it seems interesting. I'm going to go back into it. Their save file carries over with your Google account, which is good, but I realized they made so many changes that since I haven't played so long, they don't give you tutorials or the updates that happen you know, unless you start from scratch. Ooh, got some fun. So yeah, I decided to start a new game entirely. So <laughs> I lost all my characters because basically every final character that's ever created is in this game in one game. So there's a lot, but because I'm not understanding anything anyway, and I lost a lot of loot because of there's all these updates, it was better off starting again. But yeah, I'm glad I did. It's actually a lot of fun. Forgot how fun this one is. It actually got dark pretty fast today. Um, 
like I get it when it's really hot usually it's followed by like rain like heavy rain or even a thunderstorm but since we're in June I didn't think much of it like it happened like at the end of May where it didn't wasn't it was a thunderstorm and it was raining really hard after a really hot weekend but it's June so I don't know but the clouds like pretty dark I can't really show you guys here let me just ask the bitch <laughs> hey Google what's the weather like tomorrow a high of oh. 26 and a low of 15. I really don't trust Google because it's been wrong for like a week and a half now. And it's very windy. Very, very windy. And, you know, it's very dark and cloudy. I don't know if that's true. <laughs> it's been wrong for like a week and a half. So, we'll see. But yeah. Um, I am probably going to grab a shower right now. And that's probably going to be what I'm going to be doing for the rest of the... Oop, kind of flossy. <laughs> which light? I didn't turn on much light. Because I was, like, falling asleep um, folding laundry just now, so... <laughs> it's almost nine. So, yeah. So I'm going to grab a shower and then relax. Maybe I'll edit a video and then fall asleep probably around 10 o'clock again. Which is a good thing. <laughs> but I'm probably going to end the week here. First week back. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you all next week.